Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here, from what we have here, which is 9 raised to power x equals to 36. Yeah, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 9 raised to power x equals to log 36. The next step here, we apply the power of log room. When we have log m, raised to power p, this same thing as p log m, that is, yeah, this becomes x log 9 equals to log 36. The next step here, we divide both side by log 9, divide this side by log 9, also divide this side by log 9, which implies here, log 9 cancelled each other. We have x left, which is equals to log 36 over log 9. The next step here, 36, same thing as 9 times 4. Then what we have becomes x equals to log 9 times 4 over log 9. Yeah. Then, what we have here follows from the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, this is the same thing as log a plus log b. That is, what we have here becomes x equals to log 9 plus log 4 over log 9. That is, Next step here, we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 9 over log 9 plus log 4 over log 9. Then, next step here, log 9 comes each other, we have 1 left, which implies x equals to 1 plus log 4 over log 9. Then, from here, we can write 4 as 2 times 2, which is 2 squared, and also 9 as 3 times 3, which is 3 squared. That is, what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 squared over log 3 squared here. And we apply the power of log ring. That this 2 comes here also from here. And we have x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 over 2 log 3. Which implies here 2 cancelled each other. And we have x equals to 1 plus log 2 over log 3 here. And next step. We apply change of base from when we have log a over log b. This is same thing as log a to base b. That is, this becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 base 3. So here we have the value of x in this problem as 1 plus log 2 base 3. Then let's check here. If this satisfies this given problem, that is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 1 plus log 2 base 3. Then what we have here becomes 9 raised to power 1 plus log 2 base 3. Is it equals to 36 on this side? Then, here we apply the law of indices. When we have a raised to power m plus n, the same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. At this here, this becomes 9 raised to power 1 times 9 raised to power log 2 with 3. Is it equals to 36 on this side? 
Then nine is to the power one, same thing as nine. Then times here yeah, we can express nine as three square, which is raised to power log two base three is equals to thirty six on this side. That is here we have nine times. This power multiplies you have three raised to the power two log two base three. Is it equals to thirty six on this side? And from here, we reverse this two from power law. When we have p log m, which is same thing as log m raised to power p, then here we have nine times three raised to power log two squared. Now is three is equals to thirty six. Yeah. Then this becomes nine times three raised to power log two squared. That's four. Base three. Is equals to 36 here. Then this follows from the law of logarithm. When we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. And here this is same thing as 4. That is 9 times 4 is equals to 36 from here. And of course, 9 times 4 equals 36, which is equals to 36 here. Then the left hand side equals to the right. And side, and therefore, we conclude that x equals to one plus log two base three satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video, give it thumbs up, and put your comments. And also join our membership package. And thank you. See you next class. And bye for now.